Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello and welcome. My name is Amy and I'm a first time mum to a seven week old little girl called Eliza. She's actually seven weeks today. So yeah, time's gone so fast. At the same time, it feels like she's always been here. So I just thought I would do a what's in my changing bag video. Um, because we're going to a baby sensory class tomorrow and to be honest with you I've not really used my changing bag much as I would have liked to because like I said we have been in a full lockdown but we're going to baby sensory tomorrow so our children's centre is still running their baby sensory class which I've never been to before I didn't know they were still running the class I got a letter through the post to invite us so I was really excited um, and obviously if you didn't know I had a c-section so I couldn't drive for the first six weeks and last week last week um, there was no availability so I can drive now because I'm seven weeks post up anyway I'm rambling now so yeah let me show you what I've got, I've got this bag and it's an Ickle Bubba bag it came with our pram so yeah, it's really good quality. It has loads of different compartments and like I said, it came with a pram, which is an added bonus. Um, we have the Ickle Bubba Pram, the Stomp V3. We got it second hand. Um, yeah, it came with a bag. So, so the first thing that I'll show you is the changing mat. So it's this Ladybird changing mat. It's a Bambino Mio and it's really soft. The fabric is really soft, opens up like so. Fabric when it has like a sort of like a like a towel in um toweling inside, so it's really soft when you put when you put baby down, which is great. We also have the Ickle Bubba changing mat which came with the bag, which came with the pram. Um but it's 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 a little bit cold, so I don't mind it, but it just seems a bit cold, so I don't always use that one. Um, I've used this one more, but I have got the other one, you know, if we need it. So that's that. And it folds up really small, which is great. Okay, so in the back pockets, I have so a little black and white sensory toy. It has sort of lots of different sort of pictures in it and it tools. So that's that one. We have just two just two dummies in here if we feel like she needs it she doesn't really have a dummy very often at all she's she only has it if for, for comfort um and it's always handy to have if you know if, if she needs it in the car so yeah so we've got them so i also have this disinfectant spray so if i'm ever going shopping i can just sort of spray all the, the shopping trolleys you can spray this on absolutely everything. This is just from Aldi and it even says here effectively according to coronavirus. So um yeah, and I'm sure it was like two for 80p. They're really really cheap and like I said, I just spray it on absolutely everything. Um I've ran I normally always have hand sanitizer in this bag, however, I've ran out. So that is the first thing that I will need to get to put in here. I've just got like a little perfume because you never know when I might need it. Okay, so I have a just a little shopping bag. Just in case I'm ever in a rush to get to the shops and I forget my own bag. I always have an emergency little bag here for any shopping. I have this, just this bag, and this was actually handmade. My mum's friend's mum kindly made this for Eliza when she was first born. So we keep nappy, we just keep nappies, nappies, wipes. These are essential nappy bags. We use the Aldi water wipes and the Aldi nappies, and they've worked really, really good for us. We have a little cardigan which was handmade for Eliza when she was born. I love this, it's really nice. Also with this cardigan, it's so soft. 
and it has lovely little buttons going down the middle. Yes, we'll love that. We also have just a spare hat. This is just a spare pink hat, just in case. She always goes out in a hat at the moment just because it's the colder weather, but just in case for whatever reason something happened to that hat, I just ha have a spare. I'll probably take this out when we come into the warm warmer months, though. We, I have just a spare blanket just in case I we ever drop her blanket or something happens to her blanket. I just carry a spare one. And again, this was handmade for us by a, a family friend. And it's only a little one. It's only quite a small one, so it's quite easy just to fold up small and pop it at the bottom of the bag. I have some... I have, I only have a couple in here, but I have disposable breast pads and yes, we have the No Harm Nipple Balm and this is absolutely amazing by My Expert Midwife. Highly, highly recommend. So we have that. I have three muslins. I probably don't need as many, as many muslins, but I'd rather have too much than too less. So I've got this one and then I've got a... Got another one here, I think with pan I've got another one here with pandas on. And this is a this is a very big muslin and it works as a swaddle as well. And I find that this is really good if I need to sort of if I ever need to sort of breastfeed in public or anything like that. It's huge, so it's I can cover myself if if I felt like I wanted to. I have two bibs as well. This is a newborn bib and it and it has like this soft it has like this soft bit here, like this soft ring here, which is really soft around her neck. My mum kindly got Eliza this. And then I just have just another one with a just have another one with a rabbit on. She doesn't really get messy when feeding, so I don't use them as much as much as others but I always have them to hand just in case because she will have the odd time where she'll just get milk everywhere. <laughs> just have a little pouch here. This is from Accessorize and I just have I always carry two face masks, one for me, one for my husband. And they're an essential these days as we all know. And then in this little pouch here I have a change of clothes. So I'll show you. So I have, we have a lovely pink vest. It's really, really soft cotton and it has, it has hearts on it as well. That's from Tesco's. And we've just got a, another vest. This is from Marks and Spencers. It's got a little bunny rabbit on it. This, we've got the third, but I only, I mean, this is the last vest and this is from Little Nutmeg from Morrison's and it's got a lovely floral, it's got a lovely floral pattern on it and a rabbit. Always carry mittens around with me because sometimes she's wearing an outfit that doesn't have integrated mittens on it and she's very good at taking her mittens off. So I always carry a spare pair of mittens. And these two baby grows, these two baby grows are from Tesco, which my mum kindly got for Eliza. And it's these, it's got like a lovely, it's got lovely different types of flowers on it. And this is one of my favourites. I love it. And this came in a pack with one other sleep suit, which is like a yellow one, yellow floral one and this. And this is a pink baby grow with bees on. And they have the essential of integrated mittens. <laughs> yes, that's everything. So thank you so much for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.